Okay, we're gonna go do Great Wood, the Mist Watchers, and we'll near after that. Audric, I don't have time for you. And then what, ODK, Sage Deacons? I wonder if we could finish this run in like another two hours. Maybe. Everything went well. DLC alone, though, takes, like, probably almost an hour. The game is so small, it's only 14 gigs. Yeah, I mean, it's pretty... Honestly, man, Sekiro is not, like, a big game. It's not like Elden Ring. Armored Core, honestly, a pretty big size, too. I don't think Armored Core is that long. Actually, Armored Core, I think, was almost as big as Elden Ring was. Like 50-something gigs. Rather, there's nowhere else to go. Ooh. Eh. Ooh. Eh. Oh, that went over. Should be done in like a week. Hey, you never know. The hell? I did an attack somehow, but I didn't even hit the attack button. Maybe hit the... Thank you. Actually, Bonfire Lance rested out. This will definitely be up there for one of the fastest runs. I still think... I think the Bandit Knife was the fastest one. Or maybe it was the Morian Blade. I don't remember if there was a faster one. I also don't really remember half the weapons I've done recently for this game. It's most great hammer we did. And that's like the only other one I remember. And that one was pretty fast, but it, it took a, like, we had to go to DLC, so it slowed it down. I had to get Pavel's Ring and the Ring of Favor, plus three. It's still pretty quick, though. Green Hammers just seem really good in this game.
And we get a nice lull before we have to kill anything again. And we could do Sage. I, I just like doing Abyss Watchers first because I always make sure to do ODK after one year. Otherwise, uh, I will forget them. I almost did on one run. I almost forgot Taurus Demon, too, in uh, Dark Souls 1 run. But I think for Dark Souls 1 and 3, I have, like... It, it, it would be hard for me to miss one at this point just because of the route I do. I, unless I get, like, some weird run, like... I don't even know what. Like, magic or something where I need to get a spell outside of... Uh, like, the normal path. I, I don't even know how to do, explain it. But, like, the rat is pretty much set for DS1 and 3. DS2 is definitely a lot different, because... I like the power stance. Yeah, where did my shield go? How long has that been like that? But, like, in this game, unless I'm doing something like Deacons with a Bow, something that bad, the New Game Plus order is pretty much going to be the same every time. Or, like, Soldering Iron. That was, that was a little different. Like, Cinder wasn't even the last boss I did in that run, because I got stuck on Demon Princes, and I'm like, I gotta kill something else, because I haven't killed the boss in, like, hours. So I went and did Cinder, and then we just finished with Gale. Depending on how much we have in this run, uh, I was going to say we could start the DS1 run Thursday, but we'll probably start it, I don't know, I'm going to want at least a weekend to prepare for that. We'll definitely start it next week, though. I got to think about how I'm going to want to do that run, because it's going to be rough, especially if we don't roll a physical infusion. If we roll, like, magic or something, or fire, oof. Elements versus, like, any DLC boss will suck. And not being able to use resin will suck. Oh, I didn't pick up the undead bone shard in the... Oh, damn. I'm gonna grab the one here. But if I wait to do DS1, then we can probably finish Bloodborne this week.
and then next week we start off with DS1 and whatever replaces Bloodborne. I'm also hoping we can finish Armored Core this week. That would work out perfectly, because then we can have more time for... Well, we're probably going to be doing three runs at the same time, honestly, next week. I'll do, like, an hour of Straight Sword Hill, and then we'll do, like, two other runs that aren't painful, hopefully. Unless we get, like, the Needle of Eternal Agony, and then... <laughs> oh, God. Oh, no, stop. I forgot about this guy. If we have to do the straight sword hilt, bless the needle, I'm gonna cry. It also will probably work on four runs. <laughs> Cause like those runs, like I'm not gonna be able to take more than an hour of at a time. Because with the straight sword hilt run, we're gonna be using it the entire time. We get it right away. I'm not gonna infuse it until probably like when, unless it's like a good infusion or something. Please die. Oh, I hate you. Nice kick. I just heal. Jesus Christ, I am trying my hardest to die here. Wow. That's unlucky. I gotta stop being so greedy, dude. Uh, I should have looked at. I was. I was trying to see if the red eye knight was spawning. I should have been looking the other way though. Man, how how unlucky can you be? One attack I can't poise through. I gotta stop being an idiot here, man. Like, this fight is not hard. See, why didn't that work the first time? That was the attack I did, and that was the attack he did. When I died that first attempt. That easy. Oof, that was a big amount of damage. Jesus Christ. Uh oh, don't hit me, don't hit me.
So apparently you can't shoot these bridges down with bows, which is very strange. You can punch them. You can't hit them with a bow and break them. I don't know why. you to move your hand forward, sir. Not like this. I can't even see what he's doing, man. The grass is not helping. That was all I needed, huh? Two hits? Yeah, if we were going to finish in, like, another hour and a half, we would need to get through... In, like, the next half hour, we need to get, like, probably to Prince's or something. That's not happening. Haven't slept since yesterday? Dude, take a nap. Sleep is vital. To see something. Is the audio quiet? I'm gonna turn the sound effects up a little bit. Hopefully it's not like significantly louder. That might be louder. I, I regret this. I'm walking into a loud area and I'm like, yeah, I'm gonna turn it up. To be fair, I didn't realize how loud it would be. Trying spent the last four hours being dragged around in town by my grandmother because she needed help running errands. In short, she in fact did not. Well, get some when you can, though. That did way more damage than I thought it would.
Please. Thank you. I think he would have killed me if he hit me with that Nova. Oh. All right, let's go level up. We have like a hundred thousand, three hundred, sorry, thousand souls. Yeah, I don't know, man. That's, uh, it's definitely strange, right? You would think they'd be used to it. I think they'd be used to your schedule. Tis what? Tis what? Pretty be careful. So what level are we at right now? 85. I mean, we don't really need anything else. I don't know what I would do. Vitality, I guess, if anything. All right, back to here. So we've got Sage, Deacons. And then Yorm, Wyvern, and Nameless. Already frost brock. Here? Here. Phase two. Not yet, actually. Soul of a Crystal Sage. Stop. Oh, wow. Okay, I get it. Please, dogs. Some more armored core today. I hope we can get through chapter three. We're like in the at the very start of chapter two. And then we should be able to finish it this week. And I don't think I'm going to play anything else right away, because, again, with the, with the ladle run... Not the ladle run, the other run, the straight sword hilt. Uh, I'll probably wait till that's done, until I play something else. I just don't know what the something else will be at this point. I don't want the wooden shield.
There's a tower. Is that right there? That's the uh, undead settlement tower. That giant has a good eye. I'm pretty sure he has like coverings over his eyes too, so I don't know how he sees things. These guys don't know it. They're the ones I need to die. But those fire guys don't do enough damage to kill them. I always forget there's another path like right down there. Let's hope we don't die to Deacons, because I am not getting the shortcut. I still have this resin on that I haven't used since, like, Braidwood. Do we have any, uh, Divine Blessings or anything? I don't see any. Maybe we get some Estus back here. It's one nice thing about the fight is that that can happen. Oh, there goes the bonus damage. Not that we really need it, like, we do plenty of damage without it. Oh my god! <laughs> Dude, these guys are getting knocked around. I don't think I've ever seen this. Maybe it's just if the fat guys get knocked back, then that happens. Look at that! It just takes all of them out. I've never noticed that. Fire? Oh, it's over here. Um, what are we doing? We're going to here. Uh, Yorm. Hmm. You know, honestly, we could maybe do this in like another. Like once we're done, if we get to Aldrich in the next. Half an hour? We could definitely do this in like another hour. All DLC plus Princes and Cinder. Definitely doable. Although Yorm. Yorm is tanky. I will take a bit of time.
Brother, I, I'm just, I literally just got walled off. What the hell just happened? How did I live? There were two Irithil knights, or, uh, the Irithil knights? Slaves. I only saw one. I kept rolling into the other one. I'm like, why the hell can't I go forward? <laughs> He's coming. Not fast enough, though. Wonder if anyone's done around where everything is a pontiff beast. I feel like for the boss fights wouldn't be too bad, but it's like everything else. Like, I'm gonna escape. Like, six of those in a room or something? That'd be pretty brutal. Are there any great hammers with completely unique movesets? I think Smo's probably. The R2 is, right? The R2 is the slam. Or like the, I don't know, it's like Smo's attack. I don't know great hammers well enough though to know what is and isn't unique. Like, Morn's Great Hammer I used, but I don't remember that at all, that moveset. I remember the weapon art that I barely used. But it was cool. Actually, it was pretty good, from what I remember. I think I used it on Princes, and it did, like, a ton of damage. The problem was I had no, uh... I had no MP. Nice, nice attack. What about a mod where your camera just randomly zooms in and out like something's chasing you? That would be... A, <laughs> that'd be, like, sickness-inducing, probably. Like, every second the, the zoom on the camera changes. Just a random number. 
you know, random distance. And then sometimes it's on the wrong side of you, like, oh my god. That'd be awful. Just like a randomly teleporting camera within a certain distance. It can be above you, it can be underneath you. It can be under the ground, who cares? Six oh seven, was that a hand hit? I think I still do 303 on a body shot, which is not, like, horrible. Not as good as hitting the hands or the head, but it's still decent. It's like 8,000 damage between that R2 and that R1. Hmm? You just stopped the attack. The combo. Will that reach? Oh, not quite. Boom, right on the hand. Oh, no roll there.
So I got the Path of the Dragon, right? It's usually automatic, but like I always have to think about it because I never remember if I got it. No crash? Wow. I'm actually shocked. I'm still, I'm, it, yep, there it is. Okay, never mind. I'm not looking forward to doing this fight with a bow at all. Although I don't think it'll be too bad. Honestly, I wonder if you could just go up there and just snipe him with a bow. I don't know. I never tried it. Whenever I done like bow or magic, I always fight him on the ground. So I don't know. Chain snake, please don't kill me. Wow. Nameless time. Well, in like a minute. I feel like we could have got through DSA if I didn't die to Abyss Watchers. And here, I guess, too. I don't think I died anywhere else. Okay. Yeah, I was hoping we get the DSA though. I dude, I can't quit out in this game. I don't know what it is. I haven't had to quit out in so long. Almost there. Are we on time right now? Let's see. Two forty-nine. This run will easily be under five hours. No doubt.
Damn it. So close. Oh, I have no stamina. That damage is disgusting. What the hell, dude? It's like 60% of my health bar in one hit. Baited me. I thought he was done. And he started up into the combo. Nice. Oh. What? My stamina. I feel like even with Grass Crest, my stamina regen feels really bad. I don't know why. I think I have one undead bone shard, or do I have two? I have two, okay. Not three, though. Alright, back to here. If we can do Pontiff Haldrus and DSA, I think we'll finish in like another hour. The problem is DSA, it's not really a problem, but the run to DSA is like pretty lengthy. It feels lengthy, it's really not that long, though, I guess. And then I, I think tomorrow, or not tomorrow, Thursday when I'm streaming, we'll uh, finish this run first, and then we'll just do Bloodborne the rest of the time until probably Armored Core. Because I probably won't be done with Armored Core today. So what is that nut? What is he doing there? I can't tell. I don't know if he's buffing his weapon or doing something else. Oh, that's so late. Flick Scram, what's up, man? Not much. How are you doing?
Did anyone make a new Discord or is mine just glitched? I did not make a new one. Why, what's going on? Doesn't show anyone's in the server. I'll have to check it out when, uh... I'll check it out after I'm done streaming. Rakuyo is done. And we're, we uh, replaced it with this run, which will be done Thursday. Yep, rolled this one yesterday. And I think this one and uh, the Kirk camera will, will both be done. And we're going to be doing three runs next week, I think. Two of which I have yet to roll. And then the uh, straight sword hilt. I think we'll just go through DSA and then we'll uh, pick up tomorrow with Princes and DLC and Cinder and that's it. ODK and Great Wit are dead, Nameless is dead, and Champ Gundyr is dead. So that's everything optional in the base game. Land on the chest. Thank you. Actually, you know what? Look at this. When did I finish? Oh, did I answer that already? We finished yesterday. Should really play DS3 DLC sometime soon, but one I'm lazy and two can't figure out the build. You can pretty much do anything you want, honestly. That's definitely phase two. He almost let me kill him there. I might have been able to, honestly, if I could read that.
I'm pretty sure I got the Lockthorn Castle bonfire, so we'll just warp up there real quick, and then we'll go to DSA. Boom. Yeah, we were here like two hours ago. Insane deja. It's gotta feel like weird if you speedrun this game, or any game really, that you can finish in like multiple times. Like, you probably just don't even feel deja vu anymore, you know? Because of how many times you go through the same thing. I didn't realize I woke them up. What was the last DS2 run we did on stream? The Rapier? Yeah, it was the Rapier. It wasn't that long ago. I was trying to think. Thinking of Pyro? Pyro could be cool. It would be rough for Demon Prince, but... Other than that, it would work. Although, I mean, you could, you can, you can certainly do Demon Prince of Pyromancy. You just need like Black Flame or whatever it's called. I don't know what it is in this game. We'll just continue to miss each other. Oh, I was so early on that. Dude, DSA, stop. And also, Moonlight Greatsword? That could be fun. You know what? Maybe we just go to Princes now. Why not? And then all we have left is DLC and Cinder. What do I think about it for real? I mean, I don't remember what Pyromancy scales with. I, I think it's Int, right? Or is, is, is it Int and Faith? It could work. But you're probably sacrificing a little bit of damage on the Moonlight Greatsword to go for it. Unless you're like at a higher level. I mean, you could also do Sorcery in Moonlight Greatsword, too, if you don't feel like doing Pyromancy. Or if you want to, like, just go Int and not split between Int and Faith. Damn Thralls, man.
See ya. 38k, baby. Not that it matters, because I'm not going to spend it on anything. I do hate sitting on, like, 900,000 runes, souls, whatever. At least I didn't say echoes. I don't think that did damage, did it? It did not. Your problem with Pyro is that when you were going for a DS3 plant, you originally did Pyro, but the save got corrupted. Deleted. I mean, how long would it take you to make a new save file and go pyromancy? none. Oh, that was close. I don't know. I'm like, I don't really know the hitbox for that fire attack that well. I don't know if that was going to hit me or not. All right, stamina, please come back. That's the second time today. I let it happen where he teleports away as I hit him. And then Lothric falls off of him, like, after teleporting. Maybe not the best place to heal. Yeah, it only took all my answers. No GG, just easy. Uh, I guess actually we can go back to Fine Link. I think I have some Asta shards to whatever reinforce with. I have two. Force Estus. Pretty. Also, I'm hot bored of DS3 because I played it three times for Plat. Alright, and then we'll go here. Where is it? Here. Next time we will do DLC.